Hey guys, I want to talk about the dangers of being overly positive or meeting people who are just overly positive all the time. Okay. Um, that's dangerous. I got this idea from a Facebook post of one of my friends. He said, I don't like, I don't like hanging out with overly positive people, you know, because this and this and this. But, but anyway, I'm going to talk about the dangers of it. Overly positive people have a dark side. A very, very, very dark side. And what I mean is, when you go, on their Facebook page, it's always positive. It's always positive. Nothing negative. Give to charity. Oh, for my birthday, I want to do this. I want to do that. You know, versus a normal person, which will have good days and bad days. You know, and if you're normal, if you're a normal human being, and you present yourself and you meet a very positive person, and you get to know him after a while, and it's always positive. There's nothing wrong. You begin to think there's some shady stuff going on, and then you realize, well, they have friends that are overly positive and they have like 2,000 friends because they get off on other people being happy when they're truly not happy themselves how many times have you seen a divorced person or a person who, who is not in a relationship you know judge and say well hey I want a perfect woman or I want a perfect man or, or so forth or, or you've seen a person who's in this perfect relationship putting up memes saying oh I want a perfect woman or I want a perfect man they don't exist because they're not balanced. People who are overly positive are not balanced, you know. And they're the most judgmental people I have ever met in my life. There may have been one in my life that wasn't judgmental and that was just genuinely positive because that's how she was. But um, you gotta have that balance of both positive and negativity because negativity is always gonna be there. It's just gonna lay dormant and it's gonna pop up in a big way, you know. And you're not gonna like it. Those people aren't going to like it. You can't run from negative all the time. It Negativity builds up in you. you got to let it out. Just like the anger video that I put up. So that's what the dangers of being positive is. is People think you're fake. You know, you're not genuine. You're not real. Because real people are both negative and positive. I mean, some of the best people I've met cuss like a sailor. You know, they'll give the shirt off their back for you. They'll cuss in one minute and they'll pray. But they're like some of the most non-judgmental people, you know, that I've ever met in my life. The more perfect you are, I find that you're more judgmental. The less perfect you are and the more real you are, the, the, the less judgmental you are. So the more perfect you pretend to be, the more judgmental you'll become. And the less perfect and real and raw genuine you are, the less judgmental you'll become. You know, I had to learn about that. I had to grow from that, you know. You ever go into a church and people are like always positive all the time and then they go out of church and they're like acting a total – they're like judging everyone for not believing what they believe, you know, um, <clears throat> which is totally wrong, by the way. Judge not lest ye be judged. So there we go with that. So they're not even following their own teachings. That's what I mean by over positivity here. You have – because you'll be in a cult, you know. You'll be in a, like a – it won't be real. So the whole goal is to be balanced and real and genuine. Some days will be off and some days will be on. So just stay away from overly positive people, okay? And stay away from people who put up memes like all the time like, Oh, you got to do this or you got to do that or you're not a real man or you're not a real woman. Just cut those people out of your life, all right? This is Crazy Dave signing out. I love you guys very much. Bye-bye.